Yo, what is going guys? Bjorn over here with another tip video and as always, quick disclaimer, a tip is not any formal advice, training, tutorial, none of that stuff, right? It's something that I came across from a mentor, my friend, my partner, they say, hey, this is a very interesting topic. Let me just share what we have talked about and give you guys my two cents on how you guys can better use such information for your business or to get started in online marketing or affiliate marketing, right? So today, I want to talk about opportunities, right? The promise that you make to your audience, basically, to put it bluntly, right? How do you make sales? How do you secure a sale from someone who do not know who you are, never seen you before, and you know, how can you convince them to take out their wallet, their credit card, and say, hey, there you go. How? Based on my experience, right? It is always the promise to your audience. So should your audience, your customer, potential buyer say, hey, I want to take a shot at this, but what do I get? Now, it's fair, right? When you, when you buy something, you pay for something, a service, a product, there will be something that hook you in, which is what I would like to say, well, an opportunity, right? The promises that the vendor made or make to the audience before they jump in. What opportunity can you, the vendor, create for the audience? For instance, right? 10K per month, the proverbial 10K per month. Everybody wants to hit 10K a month. Cool. Here's how, here's how it goes, right? My program can help you make 10K a month. That is the promise. What are the opportunities out there? So if you join my program, right, you will be able to learn how to scale your business, how to even start your business, how to learn to make full use of social media, because that is the thing that, every, that where most people are these days. You will learn how to run your own Google ads and Facebook ads and Instagram ads or whatever ads it is to be self-reliant and even be able to sell this service to new clients or other clients because you have this skill that we're teaching you right now. You can use it and sell it as an opportunity to expand your reach to potentially even start your own agency if you want to. Now, all of these are the opportunities that your audience, if they were to follow through, they will see, they will know, they're like, oh, damn. Not only can I, you know, uh, get this amazing, uh, uh, or not only that this vendor, this creator, has told, has tell me this is the promise that they've made to me. I too can get other opportunities out there to do more with my uh, purchase, if I purchase. So this is something that when we talk about, you know, uh, the more, uh, I guess like more than Miss DI, whereby you see, okay, so I buy into this program, I buy into this service, what else can I get? Is there anything more to this? Because we always say the promise is the biggest thing that your audience are looking at. If they are looking to make money online, it's the proverbial 10K a month. Some people only aim to be a 5K, 3K, whatever K it is, fine, whatever, that's the promise. To me, the promise, wow, is the biggest thing to hook your audience in. The pushing factor or the, the, the a tipping factor, if I may, is the opportunity that's laced inside the promise. What can you do with the promise? How can you do it? What is or are the opportunities out there that your audience, your buyers can take advantage of and you know give you some testimonials, some good rapport because you have provided them with so much opportunities. They are skyrocketing with success they will in turn do you their favor and have you just boost your brand. So what are the other opportunities can you as a creator, as the vendor, create for your audience on top of the promise that you are already you know, delivering to them? Now again, my, my opinion is opportunities are just, uh, they are laced inside the promise. So again, using the proverbial promise to, hey, if you buy my program, you will learn how to make 10k a month. Now that the lacing, right, in, which is the opportunities inside 10k a month is, again, I've listed. 
it's not really features, don't get it wrong, it's not the features, but rather the opportunity, what can they do besides or rather expand the knowledge that, that they already have or in the business or in the training in the training that you're providing them. All right, so it's not a feature, don't get it confused. Uh, it is another thing, right? So, so inside the program you will learn social media, how to run ads, blah blah blah, all this stuff. And they can too use those things and open more doors, open more opportunities and they expand and do more with it rather than just sticking to one program. Of course, not everyone will see this opportunity. Not everyone will make full of this opportunity. But am I right to say that if, at the very least, if these opportunities were to exist, they're just there. If they don't want to take advantage of the opportunity, you don't lose anything, they don't lose anything, but neither do they gain. But the opportunity is always there waiting for them, regardless. So wouldn't it be a, a, a plus point, a pushing factor, if I may, if you were to have that opportunity just waiting for them, right? So this is something that I have been working on for my own uh, flagship program called Break the Norm. And you know, we are providing many multiple opportunities on top of the big promise of making a, certain, a goal uh, per month that we are teaching our students. And there is really, we have got a feedback, hey, thanks to what we have been teaching, they have gotten so many, uh, you know, they have learned so many things and then know a lot of things that they never thought was possible. And they are moving and growing not only as a marketer, but also an entrepreneur. So it is an ultimate win-win situation. So if you guys are creating a program or creating a campaign, think about what opportunity, right? That you can lace it inside the big promise or the promises that you will be delivering to your audience. And how can you add more value without you actually needing to sort of add value to it as per the example I've given you guys and I hope all of this makes sense, right? Now, really, that is all I have to share for this video. Thank you guys for watching this video and if you guys like this video, I hope you should like, share, subscribe, follow, everything just, just, just to check out more of my awesome content. I think it's awesome in my opinion. <laughs> and yeah, you know, co drop a comment if you guys want to hear a certain topic about Facebook ads, affiliate marketing, social media marketing, Anything that I can uh, talk about, uh, I will be sharing with you guys on this channel as a tip video or maybe even a tutorial video. I don't know, right? So let me know what other topics that you guys will be interested to know more about and I will reply to every single comment. Until next time, take care, stay safe and I'll speak to you guys in my next video. Cheers.